What's going on my fellow troops? My name is Ava and welcome back to a brand new video. So today I'm going to be giving you the best AK-47 class in Black Ops Cold War Zombies. So real quick before we get into this video, I heard that a whopping 96.7% of you are not subscribed to the channel. And if that happens to be you for any reason and you don't know why I upload around here, basically I upload topic news tutorials discussions gameplays it's mostly gameplays at the moment now i'm sort of taking that route but if, if that's of any interest to you uh, do consider hitting subscribe uh, with the notification bell on right next to it it's completely free and it only takes a second it means so much to me and uh, yeah but other than that let's get into the video so this has to be i don't know if i've said this with the xm4 in the previous class setup i said like the xm4 is the best assault rifle in the game it's definitely one of the metas but i don't know if this tops that or not because this is honestly one of the most satisfying assault rifles you can use in the game uh, i literally just take a look at the gameplay it's enough to make you want to hop on the game for fuck's sake it's just such a fun assault rifle to use extremely powerful incredibly accurate i don't even have any recoil issues with this gun it has an insane fire rate and you're also going to notice in pretty much all aspects of range and hip firing and whatnot it does extremely well i, I just think it's a solid assault rifle in fact i think the ak-47 is renowned to be a very good gun in this game so it's very very fun hopefully you guys will enjoy using it so yeah this is basically all i've got to show for the gameplay really hopefully it shows enough uh but yeah and can we just get a minute just to ah oh, just a moment of silence just to appreciate how good dark keeper looks on this gun i'm sorry it just looks absolutely beautiful but other than that let's get into the class setup okay guys so now onto the actual class so first i'm running the muzzle which is the muzzle brake 7.62 helps with vertical recoil control by four percent then i've got the barrel which is the 18.2 takedown for effective damage range i know there's going to be people in the comments like why don't you select this or one of the other ones but that's completely up to you i think this is ultimately the best one you're going to get on this class then i went with the body which was the gru 5 milliwatt laser sight to help with hit fire accuracy it's a whopping 40 percent increase which is so good and then I have selected the underbarrel, which is the Spetsnaz Speed Grip for sprinting movement speed and horizontal recoil control. It's very important. And now we're running the magazine, which is the Bacalite 50 round. So this one has, as you can see, increased the magazine size by quite a lot. That You can obviously select the fast round if you want to. It's also 50 rounds as well. I think it's completely up to you which you want to select. But I thought that this one was probably the best one because it actually just generally increases all these things by a lot and doesn't take too much off the ADS speed. Uh, then I went with the handle, which was the Gru Elastic Wrap. Helps with the ADS speed, so it kind of brings it back up. And uh, yeah, so that is the class. Oh yeah, and I'd also like to just to quickly interject here, just to show any of those people who are going to ask me in the comments, because I know they've already got their fingers ready at the fucking keyboard to type this. But if you want to know how you get more than five attachments on your weapon, all you got to do is go to weapons here, go to skills, right under crater class, then you go to weapon classes, and here, as you can see, you can select whichever class you want and upgrade it to tier 3. So, let's go to assault rifles, and as you can see, upgrade it to tier 3, and you get another 3 additional attachment slots. Uh, you'll only be using one more in this class, because it's 6 attachments, but still, it's very important that you do this for future classes in general, because uh, 5 attachments simply isn't enough. Uh, so, yeah, that is pretty much it. Uh, so, hopefully that helped, and uh, back to the video. Hopefully, you did enjoy. If you did, be sure to smash a like on this video it really goes a long way because it lets me know you enjoyed the video and lets youtube know the video is enjoyed by the audience and uh, yeah if you've watched this far without skipping any parts of the video be sure to comment down below sunshine because it's nice weather right now honestly and uh, we should make the most of it but anyway other than that thank you all for watching and i'll catch you all in the next one bye guys